from basically the beginning of the modern slide ride dot era, pistol sights have been manufactured overseas. The RMR and the Delta Point Pro were onshore options, but very expensive. Hollow Sun came around and became the go-to choice for not spending a ton of money, but dipping your toe in the water, and they are great dots. Hollow Sun is moving toward enclosed dots, and the price creeps up as a result. Sai Li has come around with their Cat Pro series of optics and are raising the bar on the quality while keeping costs down for the RMSE footprint. Story time, there are several optics makers overseas that aren't named brands and they approach channels like mine looking to get videos done. I tend not to want to do specific videos for these kinds of products because my experience with these things has been pretty bad in the past. After the Vortex Defender fell flat, I thought, I spent a bunch of money on a not great product, how bad could they be these days? So I agreed and they sent me this one. I'll cut to the chase and then show my work. Yes, it survived a drop test. Yes, it held zero. The clarity and quality of the glass in the emitter is very good to excellent. In my red dots with the astigmatism video, the Cat Pro was one of the best looking dots that I tried. The only two gripes that I have about the site is that the box they included is kind of US flag waving and kind of ugly. Okay, that's not really a gripe, but the CR1632 battery that came with the site was useless. It burned out after a couple of weeks. I swapped to a Duracell 1632 and it's been going strong for months now. That's generally good advice, don't use the batteries that they give you. Next bit is the adjustment dials. Take a mega fine tip jeweler's screwdriver to adjust. They don't give you a wrench that fits that head, so you're on your own at the range figuring out how to dial it in if you don't have one. I could get the tip of a stiletto knife to work, but just barely. Kind of a neutral is that this is a mangan lens and not an aspherical one, meaning that there is a slight fisheye effect and distortion. It's on par with like the 407K series hollow suns. As far as the good things are concerned, these guys get it right on a few levels. They provide extra screws to mount the optic in the box and they label the bag that it comes in so you know what kind of fastener you need to replace it with. The manual is super concise, tells you everything you need to know in very few words. It has an auto off feature where motion activation comes on at the pickup of the dot. It's got a manual lockout mode. The buttons on the side are big and easy to adjust brightness with and so it punches way over its weight for less than 200 bucks. I can't speak to the other sites in their range as they cost significantly less. I don't know how they're going to hold up and this is supposed to be their ruggedized offering. So maybe those don't hold up but this one has been a stud. For the RMSC guns on the go for that I don't want to spend a bunch of money on for optics, Sile will be my new go-to for this site specifically, as the value is very, very high. I've since moved this dot off my carry gun and it will be floating around on review guns here on the channel. If you've got questions or experiences with this product, please sound off in the comments. As always, I appreciate you guys and I'll catch you on the next one.